Hello, everybody. This is Gold League, everyone, and we're back with a brand new race. Uh, this time, we're racing Pirates of the Caribbean, Curse of the Black Pearl, which was Ghost of Riddle's pick for being runner-up in AM2R. And uh, oh, also this, cool. and and not only that, but that was also the first time when whoever originally earned the pick, which was Game with 71, actually turned down the pick. So Ghost got the pick. Dun, so, dun, dun. Ghost, so Ghost, go ahead and tell us how we're doing this one. Okay, so this game is pretty simple. It's a series of levels. We have an infinite lives code imp inserted, and whoever gets to the end and finishes the two fights against Barbosa wins. They get the okay. rum. So mm -hmm. everyone should rum? be on. I wish. <laughs> All right. So uh, everyone should be on the screen that says "New Game, Continue Game Options." Yep. All right. On one, three, two. One. You forgot a rule. No. <laughs> no, you forgot a rule to mention. <laughs> oh yeah, the the rule is uh for it's for the infinite. sake of smoothness. I mentioned the infinite lives. Oh, uh, well, well, my brain didn't hear it. So okay, we're good. <laughs> Slow on the uptake. Yar, there's gold. There be gold in these. There be gold on this island. There's silver here. Dun, dun, dun. Ah, pieces of eight, pieces of eight. Oh. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Alright, I couldn't resist. The seafood restaurants will be angry at me. Ah! Ah, there's crab! Crab! Ugh. Yep. Bloody I'm Hires. making an early treasure I'm making an early treasure grab. And uh since uh since it's relevant to the day we are recording this, happy leap day! They will not yes. exist next year, and for until four years from now. Yes. I feel. I we'll apologize to all the. We'll see you on this day again in twenty twenty four. For all those who is this birthday, I apologize. See, I have a theory about people who have a birthday on leap day. Uh, they just magically age four years every time it's their birthday. Yeah. Well. well they get a fourth me, of birthday every year. If I I think um, anyone that actually does have a birthday on February 29th, and, and, it's a, and, it's, and it's not a leap year, they should still celebrate. They usually celebrate it on the 28th. Like, right. I know like I know of someone who was born on leap day, they celebrate it on the 28th, usually. Yeah, exactly. But they the, should still celebrate. So, so like they could argue that dri I could drive at an earlier age than other people, though. So. That, that, that mm. makes things so messed up. Well, no, I, they, could, they could joke like that, though. Well, no. <laughs> It's still the same. You still have to wait the 16 years because you because your 16th birthday will be on February 29th. Yeah, but you'd only have four. You'd only have 14 birthdays within that time. In dates, okay. Yeah, I mean, uh, no, oh, you'd, oh. you'd only have four birthdays, but every birthday you age four years. <laughs> oh, we about to jump. Oh. Yep. Okay, for me it's the Y button. Yeah. They Trolls uh, are different on the classic. Oh, oh yeah, but we're at the uh, town level. I'm in the town level. This is my favorite yep. level so far because you can just kill guards in the street and the, the oh, regular yeah. people and won't bat an eye. Yeah, yeah, you kill the yeah, you kill the guards and take their money. <laughs> and they I don't mean, even I, they don't even run away in fear. I, I would like I, that would make sense, but it's like nah. Oh, and so yeah, it's, it's people, even funnier when people are just walking in your way. They walk past you killing a guy. It's like eh. I like what I like what people just stare at you and watch. He does have grip grab, okay. Yeah, he does. Yeah, he does it on higher ledges. Oh, and automatic. The combat in this game is freaking brilliant. You just go in there and a use the aim at button mash technique. Yeah, it's there. There is a block. Mission complete. It's, it's for, surprisingly for what this game is. It's more detailed than you think. The combat. You have a quick attack. You have a quick attack and a heavy attack and a block. Why do I need the Why do I need the heavy attack? The quick attack just takes about in two seconds anyway. Well, because sometimes, because uh, it's especially true with the guards early on, uh, it kills them in one hit. Okay. Uh, uh. okay. Oh. Casual murder again. Yeah. I don't. It's very. I, <laughs> I yeah, like you just casually. <laughs> I feel like the you know the pro All speed right, runners they they're right, they're no, dying no, no. to get into this game. Obviously. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, uh, ghost! You for you forgot to mention what the rule is about safe states. Oh yeah, we're. Oh yeah, 
we're state stating after every level because even though there is an infinite life code, it is buggy. bugged. Yeah, As like you said. this, and this is and this is entirely fault of the game, not like anything that we're doing. Okay, well, I mean, but, I already completed the cave, but I'm already starting okay. the town level. Oh, but whatever screen pops up that says mission failed, it still will take a life away, even if you have infinite lives. It ignores that for some reason. I don't think you and can I fail the first long. two. I don't think you can fail, like, the first 15 or so. Wait, what? Okay. There's more than... I'd still do it I'd still do it just on the safe side, because I have still been surprised by this game. I'm going to... I, I'm, I'm, I'm in the town level, like I said. I'm going to save state after this one. Yeah, yeah I forgot I, to. I, I, I might do the same as well. But uh -huh, I was just excited to get into the town and murder some guards in broad daylight. I, I, yeah. Alright. I, I, I can say I've I, never seen that before with no reaction from anybody. And I can't even I talk just, to people normally. Yeah, I've just finished the town level. Alright, alright. But I actually got to the level after the, 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 the ship level, so it was like... Yeah. I was like, the what the heck do I do here? With the, with the oh, shovel. Yeah. Okay, finally got the final sack of gold. Alright. Mission complete! Now we be sailing. In the high seas. Safe state. Okay. Ah! There'll be a ship! Oh my gosh, this... I feel like we're playing with a paper ship. Fire port side! I almost want to do the thing where it's like, um... In, from the movie where we, we, we I wish we could like steal a, a bigger ship and just if like in the movie you yeah. do get upgraded ships later on uh, where it's, yeah. like, it's like story driven it's like, why would you steal a slower ship oh so that we can catch so they all come on and steal the, the faster ship <laughs> yo, I, yo I will say this right now I actually have not seen any uh, movies in the Pirates of the Caribbean franchise but it's not that I don't want to see them um, I I have Curses of Black Pearl on my uh, Disney Plus watch list at this point. Everyone loves the huh. first one. I personally really like the third one. The first and the second and third depends on who you ask. I don't think anyone cares about the fourth that much. Okay, well, well I um, will. Well, decent. well, one of these days I will get around to watching all the all the, all to be the movies in the series. To be fair, the sword I fight. At least the sword fights I, in 2 and 3 are awesome, at the very least. Oh, yeah. I'm especially, um, I especially more, like, like yeah. the, uh... But one is I, the public I, favorite. Yeah, and I especially like the, the Disney World ride, uh, the Pirates of the Caribbean ride, with, when you hear the song, Yo-Ho, A Pirate's Life for Me. Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, that what, what do you one. think the movie was based on? Yo-Ho, Yo-Ho! <laughs> the, uh, the, uh, the, the movie was based on the ride. Oh, oh, so they made the ride first, then they made the movie. Yeah. Oh, they yeah. actually did that. That is well, true. They updated, well, however, they did update the ride because of the movie. Yeah. Okay. They, like, they put Jack Sparrow in it. Yeah. Yeah, they actually put Johnny Depp in there and put, like, a string to make it look like he's the animatronic. Wait. Uh, no. Fun actually... fact, uh, I don't know if this is, I don't know how many there are, but but the Pirates of the Caribbean are some of the, some of the few Disney movies that are actually rated PG-13. Yeah, I think there are five in the series. Uh, there are five. I haven't seen the fifth one, though. I have not yeah. seen the fifth one, either. I've seen... Yeah, eventually, eventually all five of them will make my Disney Plus watch list. It's worth it. Where's this last ship? No, this, this ship is so weird. It's yeah. Like, what, what was I it? can't find this last ship. It's evading me. In the first one, it was actually kind of boring at first because I couldn't find anything. Right. Uh, yeah. now, do, we, do either of you guys use Disney Plus? Uh, no. I, yeah. Well, I have a friend who who has an account who's let me use his a bit for Mandalorian. Oh, okay. But no. yeah, well, well, you know, as far as the Star Wars movies, Star Wars franchise goes, I'm only focused on like the number movies. Oh Which, yeah. Okay. I think the, the number movies. Yeah, I think the number oh, okay. movies are really what. Treasure hunt what time. Matter. Oh, mm. the, 
Oh, this thing does the the sin that one of the sins that CDI does though. They, they have people talk to you in the oh, middle yeah. of battle. Yeah. So, 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 so what do you think? Yep. Well, Mark, since you um since you brought us Super Empire Strikes Back, do you think uh think it's really just the number movies in the Star Wars franchise that matter? Um, I don't care. Oh. The, I really don't care because there's too much um stupid over what matters or not. Anyway, there's yeah, it's to be honest. Everyone I have my own opinion what, about what what's what better than matter. what, but. And I agree, the prequels and, tri and sequel trilogy are not the greatest, and they're not as good as the original, but I would all say they are um, not terrible movies. Okay. Is my opinion. In any okay, sense. Okay, well, well, you, well, you have a right to your opinion. I will give yeah. it that. That's my opinion I'd argue, on it. I'd argue that episode three was actually pretty good. Oh, I, oh, I, I, I said they were all good. I just never said they were, oh, yeah. um, like... None of them are bad movies per se, and that's sometimes all you can yeah. ask for. Well, yeah. Like, my medium I... is actually good. True. That's when I fair. Say medium. Most people would say medium, oh, it's just mediocre. No, my, when I say mediocre, I actually kind of mean the positive side of that. Yeah, I'd say medium's probably quality. Yeah. 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 You know, so, well, you know since we did this, when we're doing this race today, maybe I, one of these days I gotta check my... Uh, Photo, my Disney World photos from last spring to see if uh, see if I have any from the uh, parts of the Caribbean ride. Let's, let's, speaking of Star Wars, though, um, let's see. It was the anime convention. They were doing like a whose line is it anyway? It was whose line is it anime thing? And what they, one of the <laughs> skit, one of the skits they were doing was you had something growing out of your neck. They said we need to pick something, and the thing we picked was Baby Yoda. Ha! <laughs> so it's like would that that one. would still look cute even if that was growing out of your neck. Deal do we have? Am I wrong? There's this person in my way. <laughs> I couldn't get. I couldn't kill the guard over the per over this person just walking down the street. <laughs> wow. There. Wow. Th wait. Wait. You were trying to sword through a person they didn't notice. Yeah. <laughs> wow. They took, they took it. The, they took it through the guard and did not flinch and no, at all. This isn't the movie. This is the ride. These are these people are animatronics. <laughs> All right. And the, the guards are actually the. This is hallucination. The guards are actually the oh. the workers at Disney. Yeah. No, the the, the evil I workers at Disney, who are, who have I taken away it. the magic. The ones that actually work at the the ones that work at the actual that the place is not called Disneyland but Dismaland. <laughs> uh, they're from disgruntled employees have taken over. Complete. Did you beat the ship no. level? I, no, I beat the town level. Uh -huh. now I'm uh, in state. Did you get the guy? Did you kill the guards in the street with people watching? <laughs> he del he delightfully did that. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> All right. Uh... Combat is also weird because it's almost it's not quite RPG fighting. What have you heard about Bar Bar Barbosa? It seems that him and his crew came to a sticky end. Oh uh, wait, oh, no, I, wait, I'm not even gonna bother. Start skills. Oh yeah. Uh, I also That's did I get the shovel? You telling this did I get the shovel? Did you? I got the shovel. Oh, you good? Go to lock in the ship level. Destroy the merchant level. Yeah, yeah. Yep. It's it's uh, that kind of turning controls. Yeah, it's pretty much tank controls, for lack of a better term. To be fair, it's not. I've 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 watched APG and I've seen worse. Oh yeah. I'll just I'll try, I'll, real quick, although, even though there are infinite lives, dying still does slow you down. Okay, in the shovel level, what am I supposed to be? At? What am I? My ultimate goal here. Okay, so once you have the shovel, there's a graveyard in town. Okay, it's like a part of the. It's a part of the town you haven't been to yet. Uh, one of the gra one of the graves will say uh, Edward Blackleg. Too far from port, high winds will blow you back. Okay. There's there's invisible walls of the screen walls and there's like a one of those like a fat god or something of the wind who appear in your compass or something oh, to tell you yeah. to hit a wall. Yeah, uh, less areas will actually blow you back when you have more pieces of the of the map, the C chart that Barbosa had. Oh my gosh! Or whatever you this is... eventually get those. This is where I was supposed to be. 
I went through that entire field last time you fighting, like, think, uh, I think scorpions. So you, who, who, so, first, you walk pa so you walk past the graveyard? I thought they looked, at first I thought they might have been, like, um, um, uh, uh, ostriches buried in the ground, minus their heads. I but think they're supposed to be snakes, I'm not sure. I thought they were scorpions. Eh, either way. There's something. And, and of course, casual guard murder out there, too. Yeah. So, wait. Uh, I'm digging at the piles, but it's not doing anything. The piles? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm having the shovel animation work on the piles behind the gravestones, but it's not doing anything. Oh, no. Uh, just check the gravestones. Um... One of them will say, uh, Edward Blackleg, Pirate and Explorer of Port Royal, and when you check that one, a map will show up, and it'll tell you where to dig for the treasure. Uh, okay. Uh, Christopher Bram. Charlie Skins. I tighten my belt every time I read these signs. David Williams. <laughs> Uh, wait. Who was I looking for? Uh, Edward Blackleg, I think is the name. Let's see. This one is... No? It wasn't these guys. Are you on the left side of the graveyard? I'm... Uh... There's, there's, there's a left side? Well, left. Because it's isometric. But there are two sides of... The, there are, like, two basic halves of the graveyard. I think it's one, one on either side of the gallows or whatever. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. so, oh, okay, okay, so... Yeah, there's, left... like, two groups of graves. Okay, so it's more upward in terms of direction than leftward. There's w there's one group that's upward and one group that's rightward. I'm gonna... Is, is it behind a different wall section? Okay. It it should be that same wall section. Okay, I'll, I'll have to go back, because I found the area with the grass. I believe... Okay, actually, yeah, I do. Rem I do remember it. Uh, it's 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 on the group that's rightward. Okay, is more. Oh, more gravestones. Let's see. What do you say? Thomas Heaton, notorious cut purse. Notorious cut purse. Man, you got Titan. Man. Robert Swan, vicious pirate. Stephen jo oh. Jones Z Jones. Eccentric mathematician? What? <laughs> the flavor text is so dumb sometimes, I love it. There we go, Edward Blackleg. Yep. And we get, uh, scrolls. Yeah. Uh, the, uh, uh, now what? Uh, uh, if you check, if you, if you select that map and then check it, uh, it'll... It'll highlight a place somewhere in the fields that you need to dig. Uh, okay, you need to find a spot between three palm trees on an island. On a tropical island. I don't think it's a tropical island. I'm pretty sure that's just a signal for a beach if it's just showing sand. Wait, it's not between three trees? It is between three trees. So is it in the grass area, or do I have to go back to the beach? As you can play. It, it's, in the, it's in the field. It's in the grass area. Oh, just, gosh. The grass area is connected to some beaches. Okay, I'm gonna wait for you to describe this to Cold after when he starts asking. Alright. Okay. That. Alright. Okay, next up we've got. Oh, All right. back, back to town again. Alright, take, yeah. take this ostrich scorpion snake. Ah, there will be pirates in this cave. Bloody pirates! I can't tell you how many kids in 8th grade quoted this movie. Yeah, no kidding. For jokes. And that was without even a single drop of rum. Yeah, well, this movie was released, I think, in 2003? Yeah, that sounds about right. We would have yeah, been doing it maybe 7th and 8th grade. Yeah, they would have been yeah, talking about this all the time. I was actually in high school back then. They quoted it so much, I can remember what they... What their run-on jokes were. I don't remember. I don't remember any anybody any of my peers quoted quoting the movie. Like I didn't know much about it. Back I think uh, wrong well, age. I was I was in eighth, seventh, and eighth grade at the time. So 
when yeah. The, I, when this movie specifically came out, I was pretty young. Yeah, uh, I, I was a teenager, I think I was like, but like, I, I don't know. I, I think I was like, I think I was like seven. Okay, okay, yeah, that. So nobody at school was quoting it for me. I'll grab the lever. Uh, okay. yeah, the, yeah, the one. But when you're like the teenage years, they quote will quote it. Oh yeah, like crazy. I think it was around teenage-ish time when the third one came out. Hey, got the shovel! The irony is, I was not a part of those jokes at all. I was just kind of... I had to listen to them. Yeah. It took me forever to realize where it was from, bizarrely. What they were eh. talking about. Wait, wait, what? Where is that from? Oh, you, oh, it, that must be a pirate's quote. So what... I, oh, okay, I need to find... No, no, I need it, I need my sword right now. Get my sword out. Snake. Or whatever uh, they're supposed okay. to be. Select map. Do L and R? Oh, yes, they do. In the ship levels, they do something. Never mind. Uh, yeah, need... that's what, that's what cannons. And uh, if you have your sword out, R blocks. But I rarely use that, except for against certain enemies. Okay. Okay. If I find something that actually can best me in sword combat, I'll let you know. These uh, pirates are pretty good. These pirates are pretty competent. I mean, the guards. Man, the guards are the guards. terrible. The guards are terrible. I mean. You, just, you know they're you terrible if the, if the, um... <laughs> so that's why the people don't mind them dying. This yeah, is they normal. are very, yeah. Oh my gosh. Wait, wait, is this the third? <gasps> Three palm trees! On what? That could fit on one screen at once. This must be it. You found him. Oh like no, but this him. crab is trying to duel me for this treasure. You can try the market. <gasps> the shovel's doing something! Aha, oh, I found a map key. What's it doing? Okay, uh, dig uh, can you change over from the sword to the shovel? Select. Uh, yes, you hit select and it pulls up a menu and then you just cycle to it. Oh, kind of like the Zelda games in a way. Yeah, in a way, yeah. Alright. Uh, okay, but where am I supposed to dig? Uh, <laughs> as, <laughs> as I was trying to explain earlier, there's a part of town you haven't been to through a gate and like the... The recording's not out yet. Riddles, so. In the down leftish, the down leftish section of town, like the one that doesn't have the market, it's explaining's weird. But oh. there's a there's a screen there's a, there's an area of town with a graveyard. Uh, check graves there, and one of them will have a treasure map. Okay, I will look for a gravestone. Approach a gravestone and press the A button to read the inscription. Yep, you're in the graveyard. Oh, looks like I found it then. You right. found the graveyard. Do I get this? Do I have the treasure? Uh, oh, level down. Yay. Mission complete. Save state. Alright. Bet. Da, da, Alright. Da, 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 da. Alright. I be, I be back on the ship now. I be back on the ship. Fire! <laughs> oh my gosh, we got the beatnik pirate. So... So what? Yep. So one of these gravestones blind. Never mind. is the is the right one to dig up. Uh, one of those gravestones, you check it, and it should say, uh, I believe, the, I believe the name I said was Edward Blackleg. Uh, that Skin, yeah. Scott Skinner. Edward Blackleg's grave will have it when you check it, and map will spawn in. Okay. David Williams. Okay, he said halt. Why did he talk to me? It's weird. Christopher weird. Rams. Right. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, yeah. Okay, Wait, this makes more sense. That was all. There's... That was well, that was all three of them, but none of them said said that name you were mentioning. <laughs> uh, go. Okay, so you must be on the top section. There's a section oh. to the right. Oh. Okay. Stephen Jones. Yep, Jonesy Jones. Oh, by the way. Oh, by the way, this is fun. I have a flintlock pistol now. Marcus Wortham. Edward Blackleg. Pirate and explorer of Port Royal. That should spawn in a map now. Yep, it uh. did. Yep. And now if you scroll to the now if you scroll uh. to the map, uh. this you looks like some it. sort of map. Uh. Okay, get out from that angle. Huh. This right. is a match for my horizontal Destroy mash A slice. technique. What's next? You just slash right? What's next? Now you, now you check where now the map will show you like a visual cue of where to dig. 
Okay. Alright, how do I access it? You 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 scroll over to you scroll over to it like you select it and then you. Oh uh, oh uh, oh okay yeah. okay. Yeah, it show, it pops up into your inventory. Sword fighting makes me think of that one chess game where a pawn's fighting a pawn. <laughs> you know which one I'm talking about? It was like for the old computer, and they would all fight each other. The the uh, castles turned to golems. Oh yeah. And and the, and the queen had like it was like a witch. Oh, we got five minutes, by the way. Okay, um, so the map says uh, three trees and an X in the center. And now, what do I... Oh. Okay, I, I don't even know what to do. I I killed Guard you're on the, Leech. You're on, the next, you're on the next level? Okay, so... Uh, I've killed... The next screen over there should be... There. Okay, this one, you're looking for a cave to go in. Three trees and, a, and an X. So, I, I believe on the next screen past the graveyard, you should be out in, like, some open field again. Uh, yeah. So that, that's where the trees and the axe are? There's a bit of a walk, uh, yes. but... There is a little bit of a walk. Uh-oh. It's supposed to be the stone. It's pretty heavy, uh, what? Yeah, you can just push it. Uh, you just, okay. just walk up to it and you can push it out of the way. Uh, is there a button I have to press to push it? Ooh. No, you walk yes. into it. Yes! Oh, here, here are three trees. Okay. Oh, maybe I push now. it this way. Oh, okay. I was pushing it the where's, wrong way. That's why. Where's the X that marks That the would do it. Uh, there, there's like a, it's, if you look closely, you'll see like a, uh, like a, uh, little bit of dirt that's, that looks like it's higher up. Dig there. I saw an M where I was supposed to dig, bizarrely. It was like a faded M. It, 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 it kind of does look like a little bit of an M. What's this? Oh, okay, these are pirates. Let's see how how tough you are. <clears throat> okay, well, oh, okay, two hits, these dead. Oh, oh, British, oh, British ships! No, I don't want to fight these. Get back Fish here! Slash, pirate! Hey, here's the treasure! Two slash, pirate! Angela, mission complete. <sighs> He doesn't beat everyone in one hit, he beats everything in two slashes. Yeah. It's one punch man, but it's it's even more gimmicky. <laughs> Dang it! I, I, I can beat him for only I can get that second hit! By the way, Oh my gosh, noticed, it's Waldo the Pirate! If you noticed grabbing grabbing the golden whatever in the levels does do something. Waldo, you've gained weight. Oh Waldo, my god! You gained weight. <laughs> there you are, Waldo. All I'm is seeing is so. All right. So if there are silver coins, well, does this game also have doubloons too? Uh, the treasure looks like either the coins. Uh, I think chalices, kind of. They look like chalices ish, and piles of gems. Oh, but what? No doubloons. Uh. I think the coins are doubloons. Oh. But or they're supposed to be. Doubloons are gold, not silver. But they're not floating! Well, they're... No, they're not floating. They're... I think they're supposed to be gold, but it's kind of hard to render it perfectly. Where are doubloons? Alright. Where are doubloons? Some... I've got some British ships out of the way. Alright. So you're taking out the Royal Navy a little bit. Yeah, that might bit the Royal Navy a little. That uh, might help them in a few years. Might help a certain country in a few years. Maybe. Hey. Maybe yeah, more than maybe. one. What are we on time, by the way? Uh, we got 60 seconds. Alright. Though, on the being more realistic side, it is cool when you can get people in the back. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, you can sneak up on them? On the oh, few trust things, me. it seems more realistic. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the the treasures lead to unlockable things you can get later on. Like, the first one you get is a flintlock pistol, and it's so fun to use. Is it good? Uh, it kills every enemy in one hit. Wait, how many of these things do I need to get those? Uh, once your treasure count reaches 200, it unlocks. Which I think automatically happens after, I think, the fifth stage anyway. 
I'm getting gems. What do those count for? I forget the exact values, but the gems are worth quite a bit. Okay, I'm still... So I just gotta get to... What am I looking for in this cave? Is it... Uh, the cave... Uh, deep in the cave, there should be another treasure. You don't have to seconds. dig for... You don't have to dig for that one. I, I, yeah, I'm kind of already underground. Alright, and yeah. stop! I, I killed a guard right after... Right when you said that. Alright, catch us back next time for part two! Later, folks! Pirates! Yeah.